Oh, good morning. Good morning. I don't even know what day it is, do you? Uh-uh, I was hoping you knew. Let me think. Hold on, hold on, hold on. So, okay, ready? Here yeah. we go. Welcome back to another episode of the Tiny Shiny Homestead, Earthbag Chicken Garden. It's day... 146. What are we doing today, babe? What's the plan today, babe? I asked you first. Okay, here's what I know the plan is. Okay. You can correct me if I'm wrong. Okay. We need to dome on the inner circle. The whole dome. Also, there are some spaces around the window screened openings that are still left, as well as some random divots, I would assume. I still didn't get the wood done. Let's just focus on the hump. That's a lot of material to move. That's a lot of stuff to do just in that. That's true. So let's just aim for humps today. So what we've learned from the humps is that we go through materials so quickly that we need somebody sifting, somebody mixing, and then everybody else sort of... Somebody dedicated to a wheelbarrow. Yeah. And then the rest <laughs> of us getting it. Because we're literally like making batches just like... And I mean, this is going to be a little different. Like we're going to have to transfer the mix from the wheelbarrow to a bucket up to the scaffolding. That's true because so this is taller. One more step. Yeah, this one's taller. Okay. I say we just try to get the inner circle hump done because that's a lot and it's getting really hot. So I think were that there, should be our goal. Were there the any other like major divot points we need to Not fix? Not until I get the wood on. Uh, okay. All right. So, so focus hump. on the humps today. I'll focus on your hump. Okay. Your lovely plaster okay. humps. <laughs> Let's go. It's the dumbest song ever. as we can but this mesquite is in the way it's got to come out we've tried to keep as many plants here as possible and trees we even built the whole chicken garden around all the trees but this is this it's a scraggly little mesquite although look at that tap root. Um, yeah it's got to come out though it's in the way we need to chop this back wall off because we're hitting too much sand everywhere else it's where the good clay is left so let's take it out
Nine, what are you looking at? Of course. <laughs> Yeah, you can see behind us. It looks really good, then. It does. It looks really good, but I I stand back and I'm like, huh, oh, okay. I was walking back up here, and yeah, it looks it looks really nice. Yeah, I just fingers crossed that this all works out because I'm a little bit nervous. Just with our monsoon season, I'm I'm nervous about getting it done and sealed before monsoon season. Yeah. I don't I, know that it's gonna happen. I mean, I think we're gonna have a few rains, but I think that'll be good because it'll let us see what happens as yeah. we work on it. We might have to redo a little bit of the base plaster here and there. We'll see what happens. Yeah. So, I don't know, we're gonna try our hardest to get back out here tonight and get the rest of the wood parts done that we need to do so that when we come back tomorrow, we can get the rest of that hump done and then or we could do the rest of the spots. hunt today yeah we'll see we're gonna come back <laughs> i really hope so <laughs> like are we going to uh, we need to we need we to. gotta get we need to get it finished i know so many things to do because you said the girls aren't going to be here tomorrow right so we need to get the doming finished yeah if we could get the here. dome finished we could do the wood tomorrow yeah yeah we'll figure it out guys you'll see here we're in a making minutes. up the plan on the fly as we go as usual yeah all right, so lunchtime. Anyway, yeah, and time to eat, and then hopefully we'll see you later. Yeah. What if we don't? If we don't, we'll still wrap up later. And explain to you why we didn't. and the biggest bag of zip ties I've ever seen. Mid. <laughs> that was a nice whip. 
<laughs> um, I have a project. But how many more projects can we do? Are you almost done <laughs> for the day? Maybe. Why? I guess I, I have some T-posts that I need you to pound in the ground for me. You know that's my favorite job, right? Yeah. Maybe. Maybe. It did just rain. Maybe that means the ground is soft. See, it's perfect timing. I'm trying to think positive. Because I hate pounding T-posts. I thought you liked it. So you'll help me? In a minute. So with monsoon season quickly coming up, like now, we have some things that we need to address in our animal paddock. We've had to make a couple changes because we're trying to wean the babies and what we had before wasn't working out. So we've improved it. And while it's working, now the babies have the goat shelter and the moms have no shelter. Goats hate rain. We gotta make another structure quickly. We're not gonna have time to do earth bags like we would love to do. So we're just gonna build something real quick so that they have some shelter from the rain. See, like I said, monsoon season is here. So we gotta get this done quick. We threw this up really quick one night um, at, in the dark. So it's not perfect, but it's keeping the babies away from the moms, except for her. She puts her head through and is nursing from her mom. So we'll come back and add some chicken wire to the bottom part of this. I gotta fix that. This is our goat shelter for the babies. So we gotta make something on this side for the mom. And I'm thinking it may go there or it might go down there. So the more I look around the paddock and trying to find out what the best solution for putting this shelter where rain won't get to it, won't get into the inside, but also a place that's level enough that we don't have to do a lot of work. So I think it's going right behind the spool. There's a big flat area. So now I just need to get all the pallets out here and T-posts and the T-post pounder and get started.
love you so much. Dial in 615. Ah. <laughs> Cannot wait until you are in your new home. Far away. <laughs> Just a quick stop at the local hardware store to grab some metal panels to finish up this goat shelter before the rain comes. Well, we did not beat the rain. The goats are gonna be so mad, but there's only so much we can do. the sun is setting we're finally back here we're gonna start humping up that other side of the inner circle did you just say humping up did i say humping up you did say humping up <laughs> <laughs> guys we're not really gonna do it there's no humping up there's no humping. it's not happening <laughs> things are not happening <laughs> we have worked all day that goat shelter took a lot longer than originally planned I don't know why you originally planned it to take any less time than it's actually going to hey, take. Hey, but guess what? It's almost done. We're one panel short, but it's almost done. Yeah, it's a little janky looking right now, but we're going to fix it. Yeah. Because we can't handle it. We, yeah. Yeah. We have a few things we need to fix, but we'll get to that later. But not bad for an afternoon's work. Hey, do you want to talk about chicken green? What about it? We're not going to be working on it today. We are going to just finish the day. So how are we going to do the domes tomorrow? The humps? Because the humps. How are we going to do the humps tomorrow? Because... Uh, I think it's going to have to be in the evening because I have things I have to do in the morning. Oh, okay. Okay. I think we're going to go back to evening. But I need to start, like, what time is it right now? I don't know. We need to start about 30 minutes before right now because this is, like, the greatest temperature. It is for And the winds or the sun's not killing us. So I would like to try a little evening. Okay. 
Yeah. A I mean, later it, in the at this point, I guess it doesn't really matter because we're putting stuff on the top mm -hmm. and it's going to get sun no matter what we do. Yeah. So. There is just one section I would like to fix that we did today. Um, coming from the top of the hump down to the buttress, I would like to make that a little more gentle yeah. and and a little higher on the on the little buttress. We part. just ran out of material and we didn't want to make another one because yeah. we'd already cleaned out the cement mixer. Yeah, and I was like, oh, I'll just do it later. Mm -hmm. We're not. I'll do it tomorrow. Nine, nine. So just a few things we need to fix and then <sighs> tomorrow we also... Are you gonna? Do you sorry, wanna sorry. pay attention? Nine to nine me? needs pets. Hold on. No, nine nine is fine. Okay. Okay. Sorry. No. Oh. Get out. Ninja attack. Okay. Um. What's this? I think you were saying that we're gonna work on the humps tomorrow. Mhm. Mm and that's all. In is the this, evening. Whenever. I would like to. Do our, that. Listen, our days could change at a moment's notice. Who knows what will happen tomorrow? It's true. I need to finish. Are you done? Do you, yeah. Do you no, need a minute? No, I'm good. Okay. I'm good. I need to finish the wood. <laughs> hey, thanks for hanging out with us today. We know it was a little weird. Mm -hmm. We did not come back to work in the chicken garden, but we did do another random project. Because you know what? We live on a homestead. And there's always animals that need something. Animals always have an emergency. Oh, so... Okay. Sorry, go ahead. No, no, the animals already have an emergency. Yep. Yep. They do. Anything else you want to say? Nope. Okay. That's it. Guys, thanks for hanging out with us. We will see you tomorrow. You can't seem to find your garden. When days are dull, you feel solid. To grasp this buzzing in your ears But these days all end in the gutter